games can be medicine. I think that we could see games uh, prescribed as medicine within the next year. ADHD, attention deficit disorder, post-traumatic stress disorder, traumatic brain injury, depression, anxiety, Alzheimer's disease. All of these conditions have challenges of cognitive control. So the idea is that video games could be created in a very specific way to activate exactly those brain networks that we most want to improve. in its phase three pivotal clinical trial right now. And we're, we're incredibly excited about it. As you play the game, the game is recording how fast you are, how accurate you are in real time. And then it's using that data to scale the challenge in an appropriate way to your abilities. So like a personal trainer, every single second of gameplay just pushing you along, applying uh, pressure over time, continuous pressure to those networks that were activated by the gameplay themselves to improve its function. Most parents are not entirely comfortable with the medication pathway for children. And so I think there is an incredible opportunity for global impact here. Nearly everyone in North America has a cell phone, and we want this medicine to be available to a huge group of people. So the idea of a video game as medicine might have sounded ridiculous and kind of silly five to 10 years ago, but I think our kids are gonna look at our generation and say, how did you guys not know this sooner? Like, it's ridiculous. We work here, we pay taxes here, we go to school here, we contribute to this country, and we are what makes this country great. Thank you for having me here.